<laughs> Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back uh, with a with a look from my new color pop haul, and it's been a while since I did a color pop haul. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. I started off with Glow Oil SPF 50 today. Did go ahead and use the Pretty Fresh, and this is the Fair 30 shade. And this is the Pretty Fresh Foundation by Color Pop. As far as what I went ahead and did for the cheeks today, started off with the ColourPop Villa Beach uh, bronzer. And so, yeah, this is what I got there. And so that's what I have on. Um, as far as my cheek color today, I went with a different one that's a little bit more difficult to work with. This is Bardo and it's a Super Shock Cheek Color. Um, it's been around for a long time. And uh, this one, you have to be kind of careful because you can get way too much color. But it's, and it comes off more red. For some reason on camera, it's looking more bronze, but it definitely comes off more red. And so I went ahead and used this today, and um, I think it really worked with this uh, particular eye look. And so um, usually, my first inclination would be to go with the peachy blush with this these kind of colors, but I think the red worked out really well, and I was happy with it. So, uh, yeah, that's what I have on there. And then I did go ahead and get one of these liquid lights, and mine's in sun o'clock. So I got the lightest one. It's a gold one, and that's what I have on as far as the highlighter. It does tend to be a really blinding highlighter. Let me go ahead and just swatch here. Yeah, it's one of those blinding ones, so I don't know if it's, yeah, there it is, blinding. Yeah, so it will definitely shown, or shown shine into the next star system for you very definitely with this highlighter. As far as what I did for lips, I went ahead and again used a Go-Go by uh, ColourPop. This is the Just a Tint. And again, really red color. And then I topped it with the NYX uh, Butter Gloss Bling. And this is their uh, Butter Glosses, but they have glitter in them. So I have both of these on. And then get their duck kind of fun. And as far as what I did on the eyes today, I did use Twilight, and it is back in stock, and I know that, what is this, the third time that it's been restocked? Well, this time it's been on the website for a couple of days, and it hasn't disappeared. So, uh, this is what I have on my eyes today. I went with a really green sort of look today. I done a... ColourPop haul where I did a blue look and now I'm doing a green look. I'll be doing a whole bunch of them. Uh, uh, this color story is just murky and great and I love it. So I um, went ahead and started with this one in the crease. I went ahead and did this one in the outer corner. Um, let's see, this is a marvelous duochrome shade and it has uh, gold and green in it and it um, I went ahead and put that, a really big lop of it. Huh. Let's put some more here. So, um, yeah, I put it from here to here. And again, it's this shade, and it's really light champagne gold and a little bit of green. It's really pretty. And then, as far as what else I did, I went ahead and put this color on the lid. And then this color, which is another great, it's really light silver, almost white silver kind of thing going on. Or maybe it has white glitter in, or white sparkles in there. And so I put that right under here and right under the brow bone. And then I did go ahead and line with the dark green color here. Yeah. That's what I did. I lined with the dark green one. And I think that's everything that I used. Uh, these, This is the really good ColourPop formula. It's the one that you 
want to get your hands on. Um, I just, like I said, I just did a ColourPop haul, and um, both uh, Twilight and Lost in Love are both those really good ColourPop formulas that just make you, yeah, they blend, they blend, they blend, they have pigments, they have sparkle, they're amazing. And so this way the eye look came out. So that's the way that that part came out. And like I said, most of the time with colors like this, I would mix it with the peach, but I think that mixing it with the red really worked out today. And um, I did go ahead and use Beauty Pie uh, Glowy Powder or Triple Glow Triple Glow Powder. I also went ahead and used, um, let's see, the L'Oreal True Match, and this is in LM1. So I had that on as well. And then again, one of my favorite all time ColourPop products ever, the Glisten Up, and this has a whole bunch of mica in it. And it's an illuminating mist. I use it as setting spray, so I had this on as well. And I think that's probably the video for today. Um, again, highly recommend, um, especially if you want to play with some grungy colors and a couple periwinkle colors in there. And um, yeah, I thought these would lean, lead, or lean more toward purple and they're really going periwinkle. So it's really uh, dark periwinkle blue that you're getting there. Um, but the greens are working amazing and the shimmer formula in here, I think they've really improved it because it's, it's pretty, it's nice. It's really nice right now. So uh, that's everything and yeah, that's all. Thank you. Have a great day.